Hello, I'm Katie Love Keener, and you are watching Coffees with Katie. I'm drinking out of my Philadelphia Liberty Bell cup. Um, a really great friend of mine gave this to me. Uh, she lives in Pennsylvania. Last time, I told you guys I was going to have a super special guest. And my super special guest is here today with me. He's here with me. <laughs> oh, <st> <laughs> I can't have a face. My husband, yeah. David Keener. David's from Pennsylvania. Yep. And Lancaster County. Lancaster County area. Not far from Philadelphia. You say it like a person that's not from there. Lancaster? Yeah, that's not how you say it. How do you say it? It's Lancaster. 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 Link Lancaster. They have a lot of Amish there. Yeah, that's true. Lancaster is near to one of my favorite cities, Philadelphia. Yeah, it's pretty good. I personally like that the Rocky series all takes place in Philly. I did the Rocky run last year and I ran up the steps. Really, it was more like a Rocky walk mm. because I just walked the whole thing. Yeah. I'd offer you some coffee, but I know you don't like coffee. Uh, but there is chocolate over there for you. Am I supposed to eat it? If you want to eat it. <laughs> You're an Eagles fan. Yep. An avid Eagles fan. A yep. huge... Huge fan. Huge. Huge. This is a picture, my screensaver, <laughs> of Fletcher Cox tackling a Bengal. So, they won the Super Bowl. Yeah. And you were super stoked about it. Oh, yeah. Walk me through the emotions that you went through this last football season. Eagles are winning. Like, they're, like, winning pretty much every game. Everyone's having a great time. Wentz, the Eagles quarterback, gets injured. And then that that feeling after that happened, when Wentz went down against the Rams, that was devastating. I I think there were a lot of a lot of people in Pennsylvania that had a lot of questions about what was gonna happen. Mm. Hope was obliterated. And then many people doubted Foles, Nick Foles, Super Bowl MVP. Nobody really knew. I mean, I knew he was good because I saw him play in 2013. So I knew he was good. But the radio, like talk shows and stuff, would often say that he's going to be terrible and that we we're going to lose our first playoff game. When the first playoff game came around, we were underdogs. The Eagles were. That was good. Everybody likes the underdog. Unless it's the Browns. When the confetti went up. And they won the Super Bowl. And they won the Super Bowl. Nick Foles had his cap, and he went like this. Because he was overwhelmed. Did you know it was Nick Foles' idea to play the Philly Philly, or the Philly Special? What is the Philly Special? It's the play, <laughs> the touchdown scoring play that they used. It was a trick play. Is it like the one the Patriots did? Where... No, oh. it, well, it was similar where they Tom Brady out. was supposed to catch the ball, but he didn't. Mm. It was a similar play, um, and Trey Burton threw a perfect pass to Foles. He caught it, touchdown. The rest is history. Mm. You can watch it on YouTube, as I often do. Mm. Fun fact, in Greece, eagles will pick up turtles, and they drop them from a high place onto rocks to open up their shell so that they can eat them. That's what I know about eagles. Thank you for joining me and my special guest for Coffees with Katie. Go Philly. Yeah. Thank you, David, for joining me. Yeah. Even though you didn't drink any coffee. But you did enjoy some chocolate. Comment below who you're hoping will win the football big game. Who you would like to see win the Super Bowl 2018? I'm hoping, I'm hoping that the Browns win, because David said horrible things about the that Browns earlier. Never ever happen. You never know.